right, so today I'm going to be making some sorrel. Right here I have some sorrel. I'm not even sure the amount. Maybe it's a little over a pound of sorrel. Right here I have some grated ginger. Over here I have some pimento green. Right here I have some leftover white over fruit rum from last year. I also have some leftover red paper wine. Alright, so before I had made a batch, this is some soil that I made before off camera. So, um, first of all, I'm just going to boil my ginger in some water, right? Which is right over here. Alright, so that's been boiling now. I just actually added my ginger the water been boiling but I just added the ginger so next I'm just going to um, add my sorrel wash my sorrel and add it to the pot and I'm gonna just turn off the stove and cover it and allow it to, to um, draw as we see okay so here I've washed my sorrel now I'm going to just add it to the boiling water and then turn off my stove So now I'm just going to cover my pot and allow it to draw. Alright, so after you've made your sorrel, you just need to add some pimento greens and your white overflow rum and your red label one, of course, as preservatives. And this can keep for as long as you want without going bad. So that is what I'm going to do until I'm ready for my soil. I purchased about um, five pounds of soil. Um, and I'm just slowly making, into sor making it into soil wine. And I'm going to put it up until Christmas while we will we'll have it.
I don't have enough room for everything right now, but I'm just going to add some of this to my style. And um, some red label wine, of course. Just sweeten when I need it. I'm gonna add some more rum to this and some more red label in the future. I mean, as in probably weekend or so. But this is not going to last the whole year. We're going to use it probably next week or so. Red label and the 